Welcome back to the show, everybody. We got that bumper music now, and it's going to be waking everybody up on a Saturday morning. My name is Rex Perry, and if you've just tuned in, you're listening to the Business to Business radio show. We give real estate agents a chance to talk about listings, give out names and phone numbers, and our co-host is... Jeff Obraski, Homeowners Financial Group. Excellent. Our next guest is Robin. Introduce yourself, please. Robin Orschlem with the team at Rest Lion Sotheby's. And kind of introduce the team a little bit. Uh, I started a team about a year and a half ago. We have worked together for eight years uh, in a group. We branched off and we are doing something that is new in the market. I don't think it's being done by anybody else. We are four women and we profit share. So we are all in on every sale. Each of us have same skin in the game. So when a seller is listing, they get four top producers for the price of one. And you're all four beautiful blondes and beautiful. That's right. No, <laughs> two blondes, two blondes. We're not all blondes. <laughs> but the point is, you guys have a team, and the benefit of a team right. is that somebody's always going to answer the phone. But but the profit sharing sounds like that's the key. You you basically form sort of an LLC, right. and you pool all the revenues. Right. But some, it's really it's more great about con- collaboration. Right. Yeah. And I think that's a great sell, especially to an upscale client. Sure. For sure it is. They know they're not getting an assistant. They're no, getting a partner. They're always getting a top producer representing the property. Idea. Excellent. Now you have a builder that you're working with, Robin. Tell us a little bit about that. Uh, one of our builders is Rafter House and they are really taking over Arcadia. They do a phenomenal job and they have a huge following. Are they new builds or are they doing tear down rebuilds or a combination? They are doing a combination. They started small and they've got some really great big projects coming up. Their product sells immediately and they are really loved by the community. Let's do this for the audience. Because Arcadia is really a niche community yeah. and, and that's why I ask and I know it's, you know, it's Paradise Alley, Arcadia are known for um, prestige. Prestige, but they're also, there are also areas where sometimes there's scrapes where they'll actually, if the lot's appropriate and it doesn't make sense, they'll actually tear the whole house down Correct. and build from scratch. But a lot of them are, you know, just major, major rebuilds. They'll leave two, three walls so you get the, <laughs> the easier you get the permitting. You fees right, versus instead the of the new build fees. Right. Now, wait a minute. Now, let's introduce Arcadia boundaries. A lot of people listening, help us understand where that is. So, proper Arcadia is 44th Street to 68th Street. South of Camelback to the canal. That's okay. Arcadia proper. And the key here uh, is that it is really a kind of a, a Midwest feel. You got these mature trees. You got beautiful big lots. Describe right. it. Very actually California also yeah. with the palm trees. It was an old orchard. So it was covered with grapefruit, lemon, lime, orange trees originally. So the whole neighborhood is on irrigation, which is an option to a buyer or seller if they want to exercise that, um, which enables you to be able to keep it so green. You have the irrigation option. That's fantastic. Mm -hmm. So do you have specific listings that you might want to do a walkthrough on? Well, um, so for Rafter House, we have three great listings coming up. Uh, They try to preserve uh, the integrity, like you're saying, Jeff, the integrity of a home. If they can, they do not prefer to take a home down. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, go right ahead. Yeah. So um, that's kind of their mission statement. Huge integrity with these guys. They are very, very stylized. What what type of architecture? Uh, Probably craftsmen is what I call it. Mm. It's a lot of Arcadia is. Yes. And we're talking, when you describe the roof line of that, is that with the pitched roof? Pitched roof, uh, their preference would be, depending on the price of the property, shake. Uh, They do a lot of exposed brick. Um, just a lot of special design details. Their heart and soul are in their build, so you see that kind of every corner that you turn. And the key and the wonderful thing is this luxury market, especially in Arcadia, is going really well. Yes, Arcadia is off the charts. We are having sales this summer in the last month. Um, houses are closing um, between 530 and 580 a square foot. Oh, wow. wow, that's um, quite a... Quite a recovery. Quite yeah. a recovery. Certainly in the 400s for the smaller properties, it's it's been amazing. And days on market. They are quick. So especially, so like a rafter house, they would probably get an offer within the first week of going to the market if they don't uh, pre-sell already. So, Incredible. Yeah. So it, you want to work with a team. And Jeff, we've talked about this before. Really important to have a group like this. Absolutely. You, you need it for support. And, and for these guys have a niche in a market like Arcadia. When you have uh, 
a pocket builder, if you will, versus pocket listings, you know, a lot of times they'll know that they've identified a property to purchase and remodel. And one of the advantages, what I'm hearing at least, if, if you work with, with this particular team and this is where you want to be, you may get the phone call when the builder is just purchasing the land. Say, hey, by the way, you might want to drive by and look at this lot and see if it's something that you like. Yes. Correct. And if so, come talk to us and we can probably get you in and yeah. maybe even customize some of your features right. and that kind of thing. A lot thing. of add value. And here's the point. If you are looking at Arcadia, it's a limited geographic area Correct. and a limited number of listings. And so, therefore, the values are held and you want to work with a group that really knows Arcadia. You need to because you need to know about the purchases that are coming and the ones that have sold off markets. So you really do need to work with an expert in Arcadia or Paradise Valley. Everything is not in the MLS. No. Especially in the higher end, more exclusive areas. Correct. There are a lot of, quote unquote, pocket listings. There are a lot of private transactions that occur. You know, that unless you're combing county records, you may never see actually um, show up until it shows up in the Phoenix Business Journal. Right. <laughs> I, have right. A cli- I, have a client, I have a client of mine getting ready to build you know, a big place in there. Uh-huh. And and his, and he almost sold his house in a private deal. Right. And all of a sudden, the house the guy bought shows up in the Phoenix Business <laughs> Journal. Yep. So he could be careful about that. Phone number, Robin. How can people reach you? 602-380-8735. And the website? And the website is theteamforresults.com. Theteam4Results.com. Phone number one more time. 602-380-8735. And Jeff. It's Jeff Obraski, 602-445-9094. Thank you both so much for being part of the show. We got to do a break here. 123BZ.com. If you miss anything, go to our website. 123B like in business, Z like in zebra.com. Stay tuned. We're going to be right back.